What is going down, tubers of the U? Welcome to Sir Blasphemy's Travels. I, of course, am Sir Blasphemy. Hope you guys are doing well out there, avoiding the plague and all that good stuff. So today I've got a little special uh, kind of show for you today, I guess. I'm going to put together um, nothing too fancy or anything like that, but we're going to go out to a world-renowned haunted slash UFO hotspot that's just outside of Sedona, Arizona, one of the favorite places I like to visit, um, called Bradshaw Ranch. Now, if you give a quick look at this, like search for Bradshaw Ranch Sedona online, and it'll tell you all you need to know. I know a little bit about it, which I'll tell you about once we get out there. I've never been out there, so it's gonna be a little bit difficult for us to find, but I'm gonna go ahead and record that journey anyway on our way out there, and so hopefully we don't get lost or make too many mistakes, but. We're going to head out to the world-famous Bradshaw Ranch, sites of UFOs and ghosts. Um, this property now is owned by the United States military, and they don't like you going on it. They don't want you going on their property. So I'll get as close to it as I can. I'll probably pull up to the main gate and just leave it at that. I know some people are brave enough to kind of sneak in there. I am not one of those. I really don't want a gun in my face if they happen to be out there. But... uh yeah, let's go check this out. I'll show it to you guys, and uh, we'll go for a short little journey this morning. So, Bradshaw Ranch, here we come. Thank you. 
All right, so I'm in my regular vehicle. I didn't really realize the roads were this bad coming out here. If you look around, it's just they're extremely rocky. If you want to come to see Bradshaw Ranch, I mean, the view is amazing. I'm not there yet. It's actually just a little ways down this road. It's about, about two or three miles. It's just too bumpy. I don't have, I mean, I have a Jeep, but uh, it's just a Jeep Cherokee. and. This is my everyday vehicle that I take for work and everything like that. And it's just getting throttled on this road. And we've been on it for a while. So right down this way is Bradshaw Ranch. And you got to go a little bit further. Again, it's about two to three more miles on these bad roads. And I am just not wanting to risk it. We've been bouncing around for the past 30 minutes. And it's just, it's too rocky for the vehicle that I'm driving. Maybe if you have a Jeep, definitely don't come here in a car. You're gonna need some kind of a truck or a, a Jeep, definitely. That's what I would recommend. But right through there is where Bradshaw Ranch is at, just down this road. 
but I want to show you this immaculate view where we're at where I'm stopped I mean it's amazing I can see why aliens want to come out here who's gonna look for them right <laughs> but yeah right this way I mean you can see just how beautiful it is up here over this way yeah it's just we didn't want to you know if we get a flat tire out here right now a lot of the roads are closed because of the forest fires so if we got a flat tire or something like that I mean it would take help forever and then we'd probably get fined <laughs> so we just didn't want to take it too far I mean it is a beautiful drive through here but you you need to have some kind of a truck or a Jeep hands down uh, good tires, definitely. I highly recommend that. But yeah, we're just going to head on back. I'm sorry I couldn't get to the journey. Sorry I couldn't get to the journey down there. So the destination, I just don't want to risk it in the vehicle. I mean, it's what I use for work. So, you know, better safe than sorry. Maybe I'll uh, take a Jeep or something like that sometime and, and uh, really do a video. I really want to do one down there, but it's just not going to be today. So... At least hopefully I can give you a little view and uh, you know you enjoy the short journey that I took and the drive so if you come out way out in Sedona I mean pretty pretty way past Sedona to be honest with you uh, about 12 miles or so you can dare to take on the uh, Bradshaw Ranch uh, road here and uh, see if you can find some aliens